Most children want to start the school year with new supplies, but some families may not be able to afford these items. So joining me now is Kim and Mandy with the Junior League of Little Rock to tell us exactly how they're helping people with the Stuff the Bus project. So Mandy, tell me a little bit about this project. Okay, we are actually entering our 13th year. Um, we are helping seven different schools, um, and we are bringing them just the basic school supplies. Um, this is just a sampling that you see on the table here, uh -huh. paper, um, folders and spiral notebooks, pencils, pens, dry erase markers, just things that are going to help them be successful in school. Perfect. And this year you said you're adding books as well. Yes, we were able to purchase some books from Scholastic um, in a variety of levels so that um, each of the classrooms will get at least one book. Yeah, cool. And so tell me a little bit about why you guys do this. Sure. One of our focus areas for the Junior League is school preparedness. And although that's really focused on literacy, um, one of the things that ha helps students to be ready to learn at school is to have the school supplies they need and not to be worried about that. Yeah, definitely. That makes a huge difference for the school mm -hmm. children. So, Mandy, you said you used to teach. Yes. And um, actually, I'm, I'm you're currently a teacher. A teacher. Okay. Yes. Okay. Um, but the reason that I even found out about the Junior League of Little Rock was when I was teaching at Watson Elementary, which is one of the schools that we continue to serve. Um, they delivered just the basics that my students needed, and I cannot tell you how um, helpful that was just to know that um, we had what we needed to be successful for the year, teachers and students. Yeah, and a lot of teachers come out of pocket for a lot mm -hmm. of this stuff too, right? Yes. Wow. So what, how does it make you guys feel to know you guys are helping out these students? It, it feels amazing and we're very lucky because we have a lot of community partners that help us with this project too. It's really a community effort. We supply most of the school supplies but we also have support from Delta Dental and Bank of America and we have lots of other organizations that come out and volunteer as well. Mm -hmm. All right so tell us a little about when when is this happening? This is happening Friday, okay. Friday morning. Um, we will be meeting at the Junior League of Little Rock building and um, we've got volunteers from US Able, um, Arvest, Mount St. Mary's, some from Pulaski Academy as well okay. and they're gonna help us load the trucks and then also go to the other sites and help us unload at the school. Perfect. Do you guys need more volunteers right now or? Uh, we could definitely use some volunteers for our nine o'clock shift. Okay. And if people are interested, they're welcome to go to our website. It's www.jllr.org, and all our contact information is listed there. Perfect. All right. Well, thank you guys so much for being on, and this is definitely a great thing y'all are doing. All right. Thank all you. All right. We'll be right back.